Hello, it's Ninja Dan. A lot of you are quite new to the channel and probably have no idea what this video is going to be about. Most of you probably don't even know what a Cryloct even is, so I'm going to tell you. Cryloct was a level I made back in mid 2.0. Yeah, that long ago. It's basically deadlock but, but buffed in some really bad and awkward weird ways. Got a shocking 300 downloads as soon as it hit the recent tab. Nobody could clear it because the level was of course physically impossible at that stage. Then when 2.1 came around I made a few update relevant changes by adding 4x speed and replacing the ball with the spider and then it stayed that way for years completely untouched until I started my YouTube channel that is. My YouTube channel pretty much started off like every other Geometry Dash YouTube channel back in the day. Random completions, meme videos, but one difference between my channel and everyone else's back then was that I attempted to beat impossible levels, posting world records of them. Of course, little did my viewers know that my hardest was X-Step and all of these levels were ones that I made years ago that I considered back then to be impossible, which were probably easy demon difficulty. One of these world record runs got an incredible amount of views for the time, which was, of course, explosive, which I'll talk about another day. But after the support on that video, I decided to go and achieve some world records on possibly the hardest level I had made at that point, which was Crylock, of course. The video got little to no views, but someone beat my world record and passed the part which I considered to be impossible at that stage, who was Luigi Man 321 then I made a video in response called Why Crylocked is Impossible, which showed me going through Crylock, proving how hard it was and why it was physically impossible. But much to my dismay, that video got 20,000 views, and then people started going out of their way to prove that it was possible getting world record runs far surpassing anything that I could ever achieve, further disproving the point I made in the video. And there's a whole lot more history to this level that I won't go into, but that's basically what Crylocked is. But one of the long time players of this level, VR Sapphire recently got 60% and 72-95%, to which is essentially the level 2 run. And so let's take a look through this video. Something I notice here is that they're not using the mirror portals, probably practice or something, because if they're verifying for this for real, in order to make it actually legitimate, they have to do the mirror portals. Oh look at that, they just skipped the ship and they're just going straight to the wave, that's interesting. Apparently there's a skip here that VL Sapphire's been using. So essentially I think the idea is there, there's teleport portals of course, there's almost like a little hitbox in that orange portal there, and I think what VR Sapphire is doing is essentially aligning themselves with the orange portal and then flicking themselves with that hitbox that they can bounce off and then just flicking themselves back into the secret way. So because of the ginormous amount of secret ways that there are on this level, there's more, there's more than one way of verifying it. There's Cassie's way, which is basically going through as many of the actual obstacles as possible. And then there's whatever the heck Kuzi Man's one was, which was doing some very, very hard secret ways. And then we've now got VL Sapphire's method, which is essentially clipping through certain blocks that have got like poor hitboxes and just sort of ending up around the top. Yeah, those, those teleportal clicks must be pretty hard. Anyway, VR Sapphire says that they got 75% in January but didn't record it, and that they might try to get 95 from zero, but they still think that, that the dual robot isn't possible for humans. So just to reiterate, Crylocked is a terrible awful level that is out there in Geometry Dash, and if you think you have the skills to beat this level, have a go, upload it on YouTube, or even better, send your record to the Crylocked New World Records slash Progress channel on my Discord, because who knows, a Crylocked verification might just be possible.